This city is looking for its personality. Its military heritage, its military uh, history is profound. The USS Adams desire to be on the waterfront and, and the ability to make that one of the nodes is, is actually a wonderful opportunity for the group. We blended opportunity with vision. The Charles F. Adams was the Navy's first guided missile destroyer built from the keel up and it, it served in the U.S. Navy from 1960. The Adams was home ported here for 21 years. They've been working to get it here. We want to try to help them with setting the stage. We've always known we were a military town, mostly a Navy town, and to have a, a monument to the Navy in downtown to me is extremely important. There's 250,000 military veterans in Northeast Florida. The Navy, it's in the Constitution. That's why we have a Navy, protect the interests of the United States. People will have a chance to see naval history right here in Jacksonville, Florida. It gives us a place on the eastern seaboard that's second to none. We celebrate, activate, and, uh, and emphasize the ship, the physical ship. So we now have uh, pretty much uh, proven that the ideas are sound and the opportunities are expansive. And this will be our first attempt at putting these ideas into steel and concrete. Politically, I think it's very strong. Chris and Tom have gone to the Waterways Commission. They've presented to council and we're getting some support from Lori Boyer getting their support is critical. We have not asked the city for a dollar, not one dime. We convinced the state legislature and the governor for a million dollars and they gave it to us for this year and we have the money in hand. And so we have about two million dollars. We need nine hundred thousand dollars. When they see that ship coming up the river, everybody's going to be very proud and be very excited to be, in, to be associated with it. I'm thanking the people who have given us uh, resources to date. There's 35 companies in this town who have given us their time and their money and their skill sets, no cost. It's been wonderful. This is not just about a ship. It's about how to catalyze our downtown. It's an economic driver for our downtown. It's a destination on multiple levels. Military, family, tourists, community, stakeholders, political, it's a multiple level opportunity for us. Transitioning this beautiful waterfront city into something truly significant worldwide.